I don't want to just teach them how to swim. I want them to enjoy the water. It's all about positive. Putting the toys in there, making it fun. Letting mom and dad get in there. We have Noe Noel. She's about 15. She doesn't have any eyes. And she has a torn ACL that was not able to be repaired. This is the only thing she can do, swim. And once the dog realizes it's all about them, it's like, okay, okay, this is cool. We, we, can, we can have a good time here. I got a chicken, chicken, chicken. And they really start to like rummies after that. My name is Lisa Goble. We're at Rummies Beach Club in Spring, Texas. So it's a private dog park. And inside that private dog park is a private dog pool. Rummy's was inspired by Rummy. Rummy was a blind Siberian Husky who was found on the streets of Houston and I agreed to foster him. And we entered him in a contest and he ended up winning that contest in Hollywood. And Rummy won $5,000 of dog food for the rescue organization. To win, Rummy had to go out and meet people and get them to vote for him. And that's where the inspiration happened. Watching people meet Rummy and start following Rummy and getting down on the floor and just laying with him and letting him kiss him. And he inspired so many people in so many ways and I wanted to take that bond and those emotions and do something with it. And so I bought this place. I learned more about swimming with dogs and here we are. <laughs> when you come to Rummy's, the entire facility is yours. Because it's private, that attracts a lot of people that have dogs with issues. My adult wolfhound fell into two different pools at friends' houses in the backyard, and it startled him, so he panicked and actually started to drown. Because he's 150 pounds, that was just dangerous for both of us, for me to try to rescue him. So I started him on swimming lessons here so that hopefully he can start saving himself. Good boy! We brought Yogi Bear. He's 12. He's had juvenile cataracts his whole life. He only sees shadows. We have Noe Noel, she's about 15. She doesn't have any eyes. And she has a torn ACL that was not able to be repaired. This is the only thing she can do, is swim. And then we have our three-legged mini, and the benefits for her have been amazing. So when you come here and you watch your dogs run around, and you haven't ever been able to, to see your dog do that, I've had people just start crying because they're watching their dog be a dog, and it's like, oh my God, I've never seen my dog do that. Today I brought Coco and Sadie. We've been coming six years, my girls love it. Um, I brought Sadie because she's overweight, and it's hard for her to do any exercise out in the summer because it's too hot. So the perfect thing is to be in the cool water. And Coco, she's not very social with other people or dogs. So this is private, so she can come and do her thing and not be worried about other people or dogs. Because some of the dogs that come here have issues, it, it doesn't happen in five minutes. It doesn't happen in five minutes for normal dogs. But with scared dogs or handicapped dogs or dogs that are older, there's all kinds of things we can do within the water, but getting them used to just enjoying water is the secret. 